So today we're going to talk about keto rash. Most likely it's a vitamin B2 deficiency. When you do keto, and what's different about keto is you're doing more fat, right? Uh, well, actually B2 is involved in fat metabolism. The more fat that you eat, the more B2 that you will need. So if you're going into the ketogenic diet with a vitamin B2 deficiency or even a subclinical vitamin B2 deficiency, everything is magnified. And one of the big symptoms of not having enough B2 is skin issues, dandruff. It's called subarytic dermatitis, where the skin is rough and scaly is really a B2 deficiency. And then you can have cracked skin on your heels, around your mouth, around your nose. Um, it's really a B2 deficiency. And then another question people have is like, why would I have a subclinical deficiency of B2? Well, it could be you don't have enough hydrochloric acid in your stomach. Without hydrochloric acid, you can't break down the food to extract the vitamins. So this would be very common. And the way that you would know that you would have an hydrochloric acid deficiency is if you had heartburn or GERD or you have gas or you have pain in the stomach when you eat protein. Also, the use of a tanning bed can create a vitamin B2 deficiency. This is a big one, consuming a lot of refined foods, refined grains. Alcohol will do it. Gut damage. So let's say you're consuming enough B2 from the diet, but you can't absorb it because you have either IBS or Crohn's or celiac or some type of inflammation in your gut. Another really common problem right here. And liver damage is another common one, whether you have a fatty liver or cirrhosis or inflammation. Now, to correct this condition, most people will handle it using nutritional yeast. Um, however, some people, if they're very deficient, might need to take uh, B2 as a separate supplement. I would take a version that is called Activated, uh, and you can find it online anywhere. Anyway, thanks for watching, and I hope this helps you. So if you want to get notified with all my content, click the notification bell next to subscribed.